In this particular example, we're going to walk through why Canvas Gradebook places all grader assignments without a due date in the last grading period of your gradebook. It can uh, create the feeling of your grades disappearing. The grades uh, are never disappear. You can see here in this particular example that uh, under all grading periods listed tabbed here on the left, all the assignments uh, for this particular course are listed. However, you'll notice that there are a number of assignments, such as some of the uh, assessments, such as a lab or a quiz or maybe a participation grade or a test, um, that aren't showing up in the correct quarter. And that has to do, and we'll take a look at this first one, the conservation of mass lab, um, has to do with the fact that no due date um, was assigned. Um, so an example of why this occurs is you might want to give uh, a grade for students uh, for something that they're not submitting in Canvas um, or in an assignment that requires a due date. Uh, a practice to consider to ensure that it shows up in the right section of your gradebook is to select the calendar. And let's say this in this particular case, the first term ended on October 25th. I might just uh, choose to go ahead and place it on October 24th. And that way, as soon as I give it a uh, due date, uh, it will show up in the right grading period of my gradebook. Again, um, this has to do with the fact that Canvas by default will place any assignment um, uh, that does not have a due date in your last grading period. So if you wanted to calculate correctly in the right grading period, you want to make sure that every assignment uh, has a correct due date.